how to achieve our goals. The mind always recovers a mental balance. The brain is an amazing organ that forms a so-called resting state, which ensures the stability and continuance of the mind from birth to death. And in the brain, a stimulus uh, disturbs this balance, but after stimulus, the balance is always recovered. The pendulum always reaches the equilibrium position. In the 1950s, Festinger realized this mental balance and its importance. What he noticed, if we do things that is not true to our core beliefs, then the mind will change its core beliefs to be congruent with the new actions, uh, words, uh, behavior. If we look at the pendulum, these changes will distort the balance state. There will be a new balance but it's not going to be congruent with our earlier beliefs and it will not be congruent with the truth either. This new polarized vision doesn't serve our interest. How does this come about? Well, when we try to serve some idea outside of ourselves, that is where these distorted beliefs originate. because the conflict of these beliefs with the truth, they create a chaos, mental chaos, which eliminates the chance for mental progress. Instead of dealing with the future, we mentally um, are preoccupied with this internal conflict. To get to the future, we must eliminate this mental chaos. The brain produces an abstract mental world when we lose core value stability then we have a distorted perception of the world and we can never produce a congruent response and congruent behavior, congruent attitude. How to 
get back to our core values. Slow down. There are many ways meditation, enjoying art, nature, are probably the best known examples of ways to slow down. Take time to find your core values. Feel your truth. It takes humbleness to change what comes so naturally after uh, in a chaotic mind. And then it becomes even more difficult to project that behavior, that humble truth to, the, to others, to the environment. Mental coherence is incredibly valuable because to achieve this mental balance allows you to remain true to your, who you really are and it gives you long-term strength, which is often called grit, determination or persistence, because you are not influenced by the outside opinion, expectation, but you are driven from inside, from the stability of your convictions. Why is mental coherence important? Compound interest expresses an exponential growth of wealth, but it applies for other things as well, such as knowledge experience in any field. It takes a long time, usually a decade, to become an expert or develop a venture. Venture is waiting. You can do it.